What's up guys and welcome back to another video. The Rugby World Cup has finished, South Africa are champions, but now as we get to 2020 coming up, we do not have a coach. And it's been flooding the comment section for me, who is going to be the next coach G-Man? Who do you think is going to take over from the great Rossi Erasmus? Massive shoes to fill, but the good thing is Rossi's going into the director position, which he was before. So he's the the coach is still reporting to Rossi. He's still got a big say in the whole thing, which I think is fantastic news. So as long as he's there, I am smiling and I trust the decision that he and the president of Saru makes in order to select a new coach. Now there's been a few talks of who people the people's coach would be. There's been rumours of one who's in particular chosen, but now recently there's another one who's been particularly chosen. In today's video, I will briefly chat about those three candidates and then I'll give my personal opinion of who I would like to coach the Springboks going forward. And also, remember a few other surprises that could possibly return to this position. So, the first one on the line is... Uh, Jacques, who who was the coach for Rassi, he's been Rassi's psychic, he's been a part of it. This lot recent talk is he's the next favourite. Great coach, been in the system before, knows Rassi's game plan, so I like it. I don't mind if he's selected, so I'm happy with that. Then we go to Dion Davids, who's the former Southern Kings coach. There's been a lot of strong rumours that he's next in line, um, and um, I'm a bit particular about him because. Towards the end of his King's career, he, he fell out with quite a few players and um, they weren't too happy with him. So I, I don't want that coming into a great environment. I know he's a good coach and he did help increase the strength of the Kings. Uh, and I will give him that credit. I've met the guy. He's a super person. But if he's managed to cause a rumpus within the Kings, and I know the Kings aren't a winning team, but you, I just I get, I get nervous that when, when South Africa's got such a great gel at the moment, we're in a good place, we're confident, we're happy, we're getting along. I would hate for that to be broken because we see, saw what happened when Alistair could see her. When things weren't gelling with him, it just dropped and dropped. And towards the end of Heineke Maya, it just dropped. So for me, I'm not too in favour with him. But again, He's got Rossi right under him, so there's going to be a lot of control there. So hopefully it's not going to be too hectic. So, but again, great coach. He was almost at the Bulls, but um, there, he's a possibility, a strong possibility. So Jacques and Dion are two favourites. Then I go to the people's coach, and the people's coach, I believe, is Johan Ackerman, currently in Gloucestershire, if I'm not mistaken. Obviously, we all know him for what he's done for the Lions. He totally transformed the Lions, who once were one of the weakest teams in South African rugby, into something special. And he united a team and, and took them to finals against the Crusaders, and, and where they nearly had opportunities of winning Super Rugby, which hadn't been done before from the Lions in long, long times. So the Super 10 days, I think it was. So he really had a great bond and gel with the team. And I think he would be an amazing fit for for the Springboks, um, especially as a people's coach, gets along with his team. Same thing I said in yesterday's video about New Zealand, who's going to be the next coach there, is you need it for me to have a people's. And that's why I was big on um, uh, Robinson because I just think he's got a, a, a great bond with the team. And that's what I want. Then we go on to the outsiders that people aren't quite thinking about. Jake White is still a guy who's desperate to get back into international rugby. He hasn't spoken about it for a long time, but why not come back to a Springbok team that's strong? Will they hire him back? That's the question. But Jake White's an option. You've got, obviously, other international guys that might be interested in a coaching job in South Africa, especially with how things are now on the rise. So it might not be a bad time to do it. A lot of people saying, get a New Zealander coach in, get a foreign coach, get uh, even John Plumtree can never count out because he's got such a great bond with South African rugby. Uh, John Mitchell's been around, uh, although he's also caused a little bit of havoc within the Lions before Johan Ackerman took over. So I'm not too, I'm a bit nervous of him. Eddie Jones, come on, son. But um, personally, I think we're going to go in-house into a South African coach, stick to what we've been doing for the past, a guy who knows the field, who knows the systems, who knows it well. I personally, if I had to handpick a coach right now, I would go with Johan Ackermann 
just because of what he's achieved. Um, I would then go Dick Muir to come and assist as well because of what he's done in the past in South African rugby and maybe bring in Dion Davids. But cutting all that aside, we can't forget what's inside of the camp already. You've got Proudfoot, you've got Stick. I mean, Stick has been brilliant in the defensive line for the Springboks and I think he's done an outstanding job. So keep it in-house with guys who've worked with Rusty. That's another option. So I am uh, Johan Ackermann, Stick or... Um, who was the first guy I mentioned? I'd be happy with Jacques as well. I think because he's been with Rossi. So I want someone close to Rossi. So Jacques, Stick, or Johanna Ackerman on my selections for coach. Let me know your selection of who you think should be the next Springbok coach in the comment section down below. Curious to hear your thoughts. That's going to do it for today's video, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, smash that like, thumbs up button and subscribe if you're new. And I'll see you guys real soon for another one. Stay safe and never give up. Cheers.